Hello guys, in this video we will see how to install JBX stable version on Ubuntu. JBX is open source tool for monitoring networks and applications. To install JBX, MySQL, PostgreSQL database engines must be installed and web server nginx or apache 2. Then PHP must be installed. Open terminal then verify php is there or not php hyphen version so php is not there open firefox see at the time of making this video jbix long term version is 6.0 but we have 6.4 as well and 7.0 is the free release in the os distribution we have to select ubuntu then os version see I am going to install JBX on Ubuntu. Then we have to select OS versions. These are the versions. And JBX components, we can select any one of them. But I am going to install server, frontend, and agent. Then here we have two databases MySQL or PostgreSQL. Then web server Apache. Once we select all these, we can get the list of the commands here okay so open terminal if you haven't installed so first install first install web server that is apache sudo apt install apache It requests this much space. Type Y and hit enter. We have successfully installed Apache 2. Next, install PHP by pasting this command. Whatever the commands executed in this video are available in the video description. Type by PHP 8.1 is installed successfully. Let's verify PHP hyphen hyphen version. See, we now installed PHP 8.1. Install this, this extension as well. Control L to clear the screen. Now install JBX repository. Copy this one. I will keep this link also in the video description. Paste it here. And hit enter. Now copy this link, sudo, then paste it here. Then update the repositories. sudo apt update. This may take time. It is success. Now we are going to install JBX server by copying this command sudo then paste the command it is going to occupy this much space for confirmation you have to type y and hit enter
now we have successfully installed jbig server front end and agent now we are going to connect to mysql server mysql hyphen u root hyphen p then provide password line then then copy line by line Here, copy up to single quote. Then we have to provide the password. Remember this password, we have to set this password in the config file. Copy this one, paste the entire command, copy this one as well. Paste it here and hit enter. Then fit. Then copy this file, which is going to initiate the schema. Here we have to provide the password of this user, that is this one. In your case, Provide whatever the password you have given. See, it is success. Now again connect to MySQL. Copy this command to disable login trust function creators. Paste here this typo. It is okay now. Fit from this one. Next, configure database for JBIG server. Then copy this file path. sudo vi then paste it if you are unable to find just give forward slash then db password see here here it is there go to home remove that one shift a to enter into insert mode then provide the password of the mysql user that is admin hash 123 then save the file i have given this password this is the password okay again if you want to verify slash db password see I have given the same password okay colon Q to fit controller to clear the screen next step is we have to start the JBIG server and agent process copy this entire command sudo and paste that one is success now enable these services to start at the time of system reboot sudo paste it it is success now open firefox then copy this command yet instead of host you have to give the local host name host name here host name is this one ub2202 replace that host with this host name everything is success now click on next step
all are okay then click on next step here database type is mysql this is the localhost port number and provide the password for this user i am giving same password for what we have given in the mysql see this is the password click on next don't save the big server name i am giving same ub2202 default time zone i am going with defaults if you want to change the default theme we have these themes select any one of them i am going with blue then click on next this is the database username database name database port default one database server name localhost database type is this one then click on next we have successfully install jbix front end click on finish now here we have to provide username default username is admin and password is jbix then select this remember me for 30 days it is optional click on sign in don't save see this is the jbix dashboard here you can create anything like hosts you can provide the host name ip and other options here okay administration configuration like this we can also we can create host user settings profile if you want to change the password of this admin user here we have to click on password and change then click on update okay so in this video we have seen how to install jbix server on ubuntu then we have seen how to configure mysql then we have seen how to connect to jbix dashboard for more jbix and linux videos please subscribe my channel thank you